cleanest air in the world. I'm a man. Yeah. I'm a man. Yeah. I spell you. This is our travel special episode of Weekend Out. My name is Gaurav. Now we are in one of the happiest countries in the world, Finland. We've already been to the vibrant seaside city of Helsinki, met some lovely people who showed me around the city, and now we are in Rovinjami, where I'm having the time of my life, ticking things off my bucket list, like seeing the Northern Lights. Now Rovinjami is a modern city in the north of Finland and the gateway to Lapland. Not to forget the official home of Santa Claus. Hundreds of thousands of visitors, whether children or adults in their prime, Santa meets them all in his chamber every single day of the year. Even Santa has to work seven days a week. This is his office. It's time to finally say hello to him. The trail to Santa's office is somewhere between fairy tale and reality. As soon as you enter, you're engulfed with mystery and wonder. There's a huge clock and lots and lots of gifts ready to be delivered. I hope mine is in there somewhere as well. So I am about five meters away from meeting Santa in his very own office. Hi, Santa. Hey, good morning. Good morning. Good morning. How are you Lovely doing? Lovely to see you. Lovely to see you. Have a seat. Have a seat. Thank yeah. you so much. It's so good to see you. Before we start, I've got to tell you this, that you are my role model. When people tell me, Gaurav, you've got to lose weight, go on a diet, you're on TV. You know what I tell them? Santa is my role model. <laughs> if, I've got to tell you one thing. I'm yeah. really surprised that you have an office. Oh, yes, yes, I come to my office every day, every day of the year. No weekends for you? No, no, you know, I have so many children who want to see me. And one thing you must remember, everybody under 100 is a child in here. <laughs> <laughs> I have more than half a million children coming to me, see me here. Yeah, from, from everywhere. So, Santa, since we've bonded over food, I want to ask you, what is your favorite food? Oh. My favorite food is the Christmas porridge. Oh. Yeah, you know what it is? No. It is rice cooked in milk. <laughs> oh, and it is, but especially. All our viewers. If you want to have a very good Christmas spirit in your heart, remember, do the others what you want them to do to you. That's my everyday advice. Thank I you so much. I wish you beautiful, beautiful Christmas time. Very good. Thank you, sir. Oh, thank, thank you. you thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you. I will see you. Bye-bye. So, Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye, -bye. Bye, -bye. I've got to send out some gifts to my loved ones. So I'm going to the post office to meet some of Santa's helpers, which by the way, is on the other side of the Arctic Circle. Christmas is just around the corner, so everyone is rushing up to write their letters. So it's a very interesting fact that Santa has so far received about 18 million letters from 199 countries and during Christmas time he can get up to 32,000 letters a day. Now that's a lot. I'm writing mine and this one's going to be hand delivered. She's going to do it. Yeah. Okay. Rita is helping me with my letter. Clearly she didn't approve and I have now made it on the naughty list. Wondering if I get my presents this Christmas. Hello. Hello. Hi, hi, Gaurav. Nice to meet you. Johanna, nice to meet hi. you. Welcome. Thank you. Uh, we shall go inside there to feed some reindeer. Yes, let's How go. 
Now a trip to Santa's village is incomplete without meeting Rudolph the reindeer. And I can't wait to ask him why his nose is so shiny. Feeding the reindeers here in Rovaniemi and you can even hug them like this. My God, so warm. These beautiful creatures are so huggable and warm and even hungry. Wait, I'm hungry too. Time to grab a bite and I know just the place to go to. Now, what's a day without a good meal? In fact, to be honest, I've been having great meals every single time I open my mouth here in Finland. But I thought I'll share what I'm eating today because I'm at the Arctic Light Hotel and uh, the restaurant here is very famous for serving Arctic food. So it's not just limited to Lapland, they're, they're serving food uh, that's more from the region, the Arctic region, right? So I've got some very interesting food on my table. So this is the king crab soup and this also has a lobster sauce. So look at this, very nice creamy texture. Nice fresh crab. Covered with a beautiful lobster sauce. This is amazing. What a beautiful start. And uh, the other dish on my table, now this is something that I've noticed in Finland, that the guys in Finland really love their croquettes. This one's a very interesting one. Now this is a mushroom croquette. Now they've got mushroom on the table in two forms. Now one is a croquette and the other is a paste that's made out of um, the mushroom itself. And it's also served with some uh, lingonberry gel. Now, this is the berry that I've fallen in love with in uh, Finland. Now, you can hear this sound sort of crackles when you open it up. It looks really good. I'm going to apply the lingonberry gel on it and voila, it's ready to eat. Mm. The first bite into this, it reminds me of a nice and fresh Falafel, of course, this is mushroom, uh, but but very very close, and I love this. Mmm, mushroom falafel, and this is something very interesting. I'm going to try this for the first time now. This is an arctic char. Now this is a fish uh, that's like a cousin of the salmon. It's very close to the salmon. It's a lot tougher to sort of uh, catch this. So I'm going to try this and tell you what this is like. It is the first time I'm having it. It's pretty much the same as salmon, very difficult for you to sort of figure out the difference. It's slightly more meaty in its texture, less flaky, but otherwise more or less the taste is almost the same. And I love the way they've served it here. So this is served with some seaweed caviar and what is really nice and what I really liked is this charred fennel mayo. Very, very interesting. I love the flavour. Mmm. That's so good.